What if you could add social logins to your Lab application in just a few minutes? Laravel Socialite makes OAuth authentication incredible simple. It's a first-party Laravel package that handles all the OAuth complexity for you, so you can add GitHub, Google, Facebook, and more logins to your application. You just configure your credentials and let Socialite do the heavy lifting. Let me show you how easy it is. So what we want to do here is we have the Cinetop application where we can log in with some given users. I have some quick links here, but we also want now to support that you can log in with GitHub, which is something very common. And this is something that Socialite can help us with. And in this application, I have already set up a few things. So Socialite is already installed. We already have here two routes defined. So this is very important. We have one where we want to redirect from our login button to GitHub itself. And then we have a second one, which is the callback where GitHub sends us back to this application here, which we also have to then handle. And both of these are handled inside this GitHub controller and we have two methods here in order to deal with this. Let's start with the first one. So when the user clicks the GitHub button, we want to send it to GitHub. And we can do this through the Socialite facade, driver is GitHub, and then we use redirect and Socialite will automatically redirect the user to the right page on GitHub, which is nice. But in order to make this work, we need to have some credentials set up, which are these here. We need a client ID, client secret, and the URL. So we need to create a GitHub OAuth application in order to make this work. And we can create this on GitHub when you go to settings, developer settings, and then you have your OAuth apps here. And we're just going to create a new one. Let's call this Cinetab, like our application here. We need to provide the homepage, which is our local one for our demo here. And then we need to provide the callback URL. And then we register this application and we're going to get a client ID, which we're going to copy here. And we also need to generate a client secret, which we can then also copy here. And then back inside our application, we can just provide those here. And I think we're good to go now with this first part here. Let's give this a try. When we now click this button, we should already see that we get to GitHub and we do, and it is already asking us if we want to provide access to our user data here. Perfect, but I'm not going to click this here because we are not finished yet. We also need to handle what happens when we click the button. And then we're going to create here first our GitHub user through the social ad facade again, yep through the GitHub driver, and then we use the user method, which will give us the user information, which we got from GitHub. Okay, and next, we are creating our own user inside our database, and we're checking if there is already a user with the provider GitHub and the provider ID, which we just got. So these are two fields which came with the Socialite package through migrations, which we already um, migrated. And then we're updating or creating a new user with the information that we get through GitHub. And then the only two things missing here, we want to log in our user now with the information that we get. And then we're going to redirect user back to the intended page the user was looking for, or we have a fallback where we just go to back to our homepage. And as you've seen, this wasn't too much work here. And yep, this should already work. Let's give this a try now. So we're clicking the GitHub button. We get to GitHub. We need to authorize this application to provide our user data. We click this button and we should get redirected. Yeah, here we are back in our application. You can see we are now logged in. We can see our notification bubble and you can see we can also like things here. So this seems to be working, but let's also check out the database. And let's go here to the users table. And we have here now a new entry, which is this one here. And you can see if we scroll here a little bit for this user, we now have also set up a provider and a provider ID and a provider token. And this is what needed in order to recognize this user again and to let him or her log into our application, which now also works through logging in through GitHub thanks to Socialite. Whether it's GitHub, Google, Facebook, or any other OAuth provider, Socialite makes social authentication simple and secure. Please check out the official documentation to learn more about additional providers and features and start adding social logins to your applications today.